Hey, man. Hey. Hey, are you the, uh... Are you the shaper of Hayrod? You are. You're the shaper of Hayrod. I'm your biggest fan. And you're here, in my mead hall. You wrote Beowulf. I fucking love Beowulf. It's my favorite story. Heard it like a thousand times. You know, with the, the, the strength of 30 men. And, and the Grindel. And, and Grindel's arm. And, and Grindel's mom. And, and, and the dragon. And, and it's fucking rad, man. Hey. Hey, man. Can I ask you something? Between you and me, how much of that shit was real? <laughs> <laughs> How much mead can you afford?
On first. On first. Hey, I'm your queen and I'm talking to you. What? 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 Are you kidding me right now? We had a bad night. Bad night? We found Jeff's head 30 feet from his body. I'd say that was worse than a usual bad night. On first, get down. Get the hell down! I leave you in charge for one night, and what do you do? Have a party. Party's not the problem. I let my guard down. You knew that asshole Grendel was out there. You knew how upset he was. I didn't know he was massacre upset. Well, now you do. What are you gonna say to our people? I'm sorry. Good. Now go find my daughter and apologize. Please just sacrifice me to a dragon instead. Dragons are myth. Princesses, on the other hand, are very real. I don't know how I'm gonna spend this one, Prey. I mean, one monster attack is a good story. It's, it's scary. Two's okay if the villagers wise up and do something about it, but, but three attacks and we just blame each other and crack open a fresh cask of mead? Shaper, get off your ass, will you? We gotta get these bodies underground by sundown or some god or another is gonna be pissed. <laughs> Which gods would that be? Don't. The chairman? The thief? Shaper. The refuser? Or how about my favorite? Siofin the lover. You know who invented her? My uncle, the Shaper of Rye, on commission from a visiting Gaiotish lord who was caught in the bat with his boy servant. Yes, yes, I heard. <laughs> that old queer needed a demigod to blame. That way, it's not a choice. I like girls. You think that's a choice? That's different. How? All right, well, for one, there's the question of consent. And besides, you're gonna marry whoever the old woman tells you to marry. Your sexual predilections... Don't say predilections. Your preferences. They don't matter. Where to God? I'm sorry! I'm sorry. No, you're not. You're right about one thing, Shaper. <clears throat> I am a princess. You are a princess. And your princess orders you to dig. Yes, ma'am. On first. On first. What is it? in the woods. Who knew he'd hate parties so much? I could have stopped him. Stopped him? He ripped Jeff's poor little head right off his poor little body. What were you gonna do? Try. At least. Try. And get yourself killed too. 
Getting myself killed is pretty much in my job description. Oh? And what would I do? I prefer you alive, thank you very much. Leave the dying to the heroes. Mm. Not a hero? <laughs> oh, gods, no. This is why everyone's afraid of you. I'm sorry, Freddy. You're a good man. You're kind, thoughtful, fun. You mean it? Hell yes. You ever met a real hero? One of those big timers from Ribe? Saw so Hengus at the fish market once. You didn't see Hengus at the fish market. Sure I did. Big guy, huge sword. Heroes don't shop in markets, Firth. They live in lean-tos and eat tree bark and shout a lot and smell terrible. Heroes are monsters. They have to be. What you're saying is we need a monster to fight our monster? Exactly. You know any? You're always so hopeless when you're sober. You. It's daylight thing. I'll scream and a hundred Danes will come running. You think you can kill a hundred of us before we get lucky? Do you? Do you? You go your way, monster. I'll go mine. We'll meet again, but not like this. I'll say this about your fixation on those poor Danes. They didn't always believe in us, but they sure as hell believe in us now. You got a plan, Grendel? Some way to end this before things get out of hand? That's what I thought.
Think he'll come again tonight? I dare him. As I gaze at the faces of my wards, I see sadness. Oh, such sadness. Yes, your fathers are dead. And your mothers and brothers and sisters, sons and daughters. They're dead and we can't bring them back, but we can celebrate their lives and congratulate them on their very fine deaths. This is some good shit. They died doing what they love. Eating and drinking. Dancing and doing hand stuff in the corner. <laughs> <laughs> they died Danes. Living life to the fullest. But their lives were taken from them in a bloody ridiculous end. We should all be so lucky. Here, here. What about the monster? That's right. What about the monster? Yes, good people of Hiroth, we have a monster. He's a nasty fellow. Probably a teetotaler. Quite possibly a virgin. <laughs> <laughs> he hates us. He hates our village and he hates our freedom. Here, here. But we're not afraid. We're not going to change our ways because Grendel wants us to. Screw Grendel! Screw right to scaly butt! Screw <laughs> Grendel! Screw Grendel! Screw Grendel! Screw Grendel! Screw Grendel! Let's drink. Yeah! All of it? <laughs> On second thought, forget the meat. Let's go kill something. Night hunt! 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 our meat ever do to you? It made me stupid and sloppy. Well, if you're stupid and sloppy when you're drunk, maybe you're stupid and sloppy when you're sober. My queen, he's still out there. I can't, we can't let our guard down. You know what's more dangerous to a bunch of sober Danes than a man-eating monster? Sober Danes. You owe me a dozen casks of mead. In the meantime, murdering a frightened animal might help. Hell, maybe we'll flush out our old friend Grendel and show him what a bunch of Danes can do who are actually paying attention. Night hunt. Not going. <sighs> Looks like you're going somewhere. We need help, Schaefer. Mom's too proud to ask, and Unfrith's balls fell off, apparently. So, I'm gonna do it myself. Here, Hengist hangs out and bribe. <laughs> I hear Hengist isn't even real. Schaefer of Hebity made him up to scare off raiders. For God's sake, dude. Not everyone's a fraud. Maybe not everyone, but it's a long road to ride. Friends become enemies, enemies become friends, friends become lovers, lovers become enemies. Are you trying to convince me not to go? I'm trying to convince you to invite me along. <laughs> really? Aren't you afraid? Terrified. <laughs> Hey, 
asshole. Just, just resting my eyes. Bullshit. You don't want to end up like Jeff, do you? No. Move around, do some push-ups, do some jumping jacks. Wake up. Anything wrong? Take him off. So yada yada yada. Blah blah blah. Blah 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 blah. How come you? Yaga di yaga di yaga. Yaga di yaga. I'm not gonna know. I don't know what. Do you know what I love about Grendel? God, really? I mean, if Grendel exists, imagine what other weird shit is out there. Kraken, imps, sirens, <laughs> dragons. There are no such thing as dragons. We used to think there was no such thing as Grendels. Whatever Grendel is, his entire species could live and die in some slimy cave somewhere and we'd never even know. Do you smell that? Smell what? What the hell was that? Grendel? You know Grendel to make that noise? Keep your sword up. Sword even work on Grendel? Swords work on everything.
see it? See what? The imp. Imp? Told you so. Yeah, the hunched, gnarly little thing. Smelly too. He's coming right at us. You know, you're lucky we got here when we did. Those things could be mean. And a little molesty too, if I'm being honest. Who, who are you? We laugh. The Gaots. Oh, there we go. There we go. Yeah, that's an imp, all right. Westerly type, by the looks of it. Yeah, westerly imp. Don't wipe it on your... Yeah. That'll never come out. Beowulf. Freywaru. This is Shaper. Hi. So... Thanks for that. What we do, we do for all of mankind. Womankind, too. Where are you coming from? Hayrot. Hayrot? That's a huge party town. Good mead there, right? Best in Denmark. We were on our way to ride. Road's not safe. We've been clearing imps for days. It's breeding season. These westerlies can be a bit... Molesty. We heard. Whatever you're looking for in Ribe, can it wait? I think just maybe it can. Come on, we'll escort you back to Hera. Royalty, huh? Hmm. My mom is Queen Walktheo. Never heard of her. She's a minor queen. Well, I'm sure she'll be glad to see you alive and unmolested. Keep saying that. Molested. It's bad out there. Imps all over the place. You know, it's funny. We never really had any monster problems. Not until a year ago or so. You've heard the stories. Sure, but... You know how shapers are. By the time my shaper gets done with our little adventure, there's gonna be 10 imps, and you'll be seven feet tall with the strength of 30 women. Men. Every shaper that's ever written about me has made me a man. Like you need balls to hold a sword. <laughs> We're not like that in Hayrot. I think you'd like it there. So what's your monster? He said he didn't have a monster problem until a year ago. Imps? A dragon? Dragons don't exist. You sure about that? <laughs> we got a Grendel. What's a Grendel? As far as I know, there's only one of them. Tall guy, naked, slimy, favors decapitation, hates fun. Always raids our parties. No molesting? The guy is a murderer, all right, but to his credit, not a creep. And you've seen him? Well, no. But someone has. From a distance. He doesn't really tend to leave a lot of witnesses. Clever. Thorough. It's settled. We'll handle your Grendel problem. Oh? Just like that? Just like that.
thought I told you dummies not to get wasted. You said too wasted. You and your Persian <laughs> herb. That's good shit. So I think I got us a gig protecting those Danes from their local monster. Something called a Grendel? Anyone know who that is? Those Norse brothers running that troll scam outside of Eros. No, no. They go by Drangar, not... What'd you say? Grendel. Right. Could it be one of the Saxons with their giants? Giants, my ass. Idiots carrying other idiots on their backs. Big cloaks, wigs. Well, I actually happen to know a couple of guys who call themselves Gomagot, and last I heard, they were running a protection racket out on the coast. Grendel, Gomagot, I mean, they kind of sound the same. Well, you know, whatever. Whoever it is, I'm sure we can cut a deal. This Watheo gal sounds like she might be pretty sub shaper. GRP. Can't do it when you're watching. You know, I was just inside thinking how lucky we are we ran into you. I mean, two Hiroshians with a monster problem. Get attacked by a monster on the road to ride. And there just happens to be a bunch of gay out monster hunters right around the bend. I mean, this story so good. Someone should have written it. worried sick. You just can't go off and leave like that. Went for help. Found it. I am Beowulf, Thane of High Galax, Princess of Ethel, daughter of Edge Feo of the House of the Waymadine, Slayer of Imps, Tamer of Unicorn. I run a six-minute mile, and I can do, like, ten really good push-ups. Slow ones. To my gay off, Rekka, we lost, everybody. Very impressive. So, you've come to kill our Grendel. Yes. He's mean. We're meaner. What kind of guarantee can you give us? I guarantee that we'll put our bodies and our steel between that Grendel and all of you. Maybe he's stronger, but he'll have to kill all of us before he gets to any of you. Good answer. I expect you'll want to be paid, of course. A woman's got to make a living. Sure does. Pound of silver. Gold. Half pound of gold. Half pound of each. Fine. Payment on receipt of, uh, I think, an armist, fair? We need an advance. Room and board, no advance. Deal. We're huggers here in the Herat. I think we should celebrate. Like we, the maid. Damn it. Right. We would celebrate. But our mead stash had an unfortunate accident. There's no mead. We're going in blind to this one. I don't like it. The two of you need to find this Grendel today. Well, he sounds like a cave squatter to me. We'll head uphill, follow our noses to the nearest unwashed butthole. Easy peasy. No attack tonight. We need a day to settle in. After that, we'll see if we can up our fee a bit. Oh, we lost. The herb. All right. Don't let these Danes smoke at all. Heroes don't shop in market, you said. 
live in lean-tos and eat tree bark and yell a lot, smell terrible. Here's some monsters. That's a Beowulf of yours. She smells like wildflowers and old leather. I watched her slay an imp. I guess heroes come in all shapes and sizes. And sense. You, Grendel. I'm Brecca. This is Wilaf. We're with Beowulf's crew. Who's that? Impslayer of Ribe, Princess of the House of Drethel. Strength of 30 women, yada, yada, yada. Ring any bells? Imps aren't real. No shit. Look, we're here to negotiate. Negotiate? Yeah, dude. Look, you've had a great run raiding that village. Hey, Rock. Okay, whatever, but we're here now. The Danes hired us to protect them. From you. <laughs> Have it up. They want a head. Or an arm. Or an arm. Now, we can give them a head, arm, whatever. You'd be amazed at what you can do with some pork leavings, wool, and black dye. But we need you to play along. What's in it for me? Cut of our fee, gold and silver. More than you'd ever make on one of your nightly raids. But there is a catch. One, no attack tonight. We just got into town. People need to relax, chow down, maybe get laid. Cool? OK. What else? We want to drive up the fee. So you hit us tomorrow night. You come in, we'll chase you to the woods, hoot and holler a bit, come out with a head or an arm, collect our fee, cash you out, everybody goes home a lot richer. Well? I like it. Rad. I'd shake your hand, but you seem busy. Very busy. Okie doke. Great doing business with you. Grindle. Hey, uh, you don't mind me asking. What's up with this whole backstory? The naked, slimy decapitator who hates parties? It's a dying dragon's jealous dream. Uh, all right then, we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Where's the party? You guys see anything? Nah, it looks like your Grendel took the night off. Yeah. 
What if the gods are shapers? And we're all just characters. <laughs> what if they're making it up as they go? What if we're real and time isn't? We're already dead. And all of this is just a memory. And if we're dead, is this Valhalla? Valhalla is for heroes. Maybe this is hell. This isn't hell. We're all here, together. That's not hell. I know hell. I've been that alone. Friend, Gayot. That's no Gayot. Tell me your name, Gayot. I am Grendel. <laughs> Good one, for real. I am Grendel. <laughs> Do you love your people, old queen? More than life. Bullshit! Without life, there can be no love. When you die, your love goes with you. No, Grendel, it doesn't. You'd know that if you ever loved anything. How? How? It's just me and my mother. Who's going to love me, and who am I going to love? You? You? What's your name? Beowulf. Beowulf. <laughs> the Beowulf? Imslayer of Ribe? <laughs> they don't know, do they? <laughs> they don't know your people found me in the forest told me the Danes hired you to protect them from me, offered to split the loot with me if I'd play along with your little racket. Could it be that the Imp Slayer of Ribe doesn't actually slay imps? I mean, I'm a real monster. My mom is a real monster, and my best friend is a dragon. But I've never met an imp. The whole thing sounds sort of fake to me. Freya! I recognize you. No! Stop, Unford. Stay with me. Please. Coward. A piss stinking coward. And even he deserves love? You all yell and scream about monsters when the real monsters are just. Shaper. In the mirror? Ha! Good. I like it. Use it.
Stay with me on Firth, you said. Be the lovable drunk. Be a coward. Live and die like everyone else. Numb, bewildered, a meal for a monster. Meanwhile, you go off and meet some huckster in the woods and decide that she's the one. She's our hero, our champion, our defender. What do you see in this Beowulf? Cold black sobriety. There's an armed rogue con artist on the loose, and they send you? No one sent me. Came on my own. How's my people? Well, some of the angrier guys roughed them up a bit. I think they'd agree they deserved it. They'll live. At least until Grendel swings through. Give us a minute, will you? So there I was, piling up bodies this morning. And something occurred to me. Hero Monster Hunter. It's a good story. Cowardly fraud in over her head. That's an even better one. Maybe. Kinda depends on the arc. You want my backstory? That'd be lovely. I mean, I could just make it up. True stories have a certain texture to them. You know? I don't really have a first memory. Just impressions. Dirt. Metal. Leather. Laughter. But I do have a first feeling. Looking for guards. Hiring guards. Good food. Good pay. Reasonable life expectancy. Hold up. No girls. Ooh, cheat me. <laughs> Here we are. So, that's the beginning. This is the middle. And now you need a third act. And so does Grendel. Hey, Shaper. Do you remember what Grendel said mid speech the night of the massacre? He said something about a... A dragon. 
the dragons are real too? Gods, I hope so. Can you imagine the stories they'd tell? they destroy us all. <laughs> Haven't you figured it out yet? You and me, we're disposable. But us? This drinking, lying, fucking human race? The only ones who can destroy us is us. My fellow Danes, listen up. I understand you're all pretty upset. So am I. Where's that conniving bitch, Now, Beowulf? now, now. In Beowulf's defense, she was... She didn't know monsters were real. She was trying to rip us off. She was. But she paid for that with the death of her friends and her reputation. I promise you, there's no one in this room lower than she is right now. Sure, we've all been monster attack victims, but we have our dignity. Screw dignity. Grendel ate my cousin. No, Grendel decapitated your cousin. Tomato, tomato. Look, I know we're sick of all these decapitations, but to that end, we have a plan. We. We. Come on in. Oh, string her up, 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 string her up. you up, Carl. Thank you. Gods. Listen up. Beowulf has a plan. I think you'll agree. Just might work. I think. Speak up. I think, I think we should give Grendel exactly what he wants. No way. I swear to God's Carl, if you ruined this. It's the only way. I agree with the conniving bitch. It's the only way. Me. Freya, I'm sorry. I'm so, so, so sorry. Sorry doesn't bring back the dead. I know. Sorry doesn't kill monsters. Real monsters. I know. Just, just let me make this right, or at least as right as I can. Can you even fight? Of course I can fight. Prove it. Prove it. Prove it how? You can't be serious. Half my village is headless. My best friend is missing. And the girl I like is a goddamn liar! The girl you like? <gasps> oh, shit! You broke my heart! I don't care if it takes one day or 50 years. I'm going to do right by you, and when I take my last breath, you will forgive me! Why would I do that? Because this is my story, and it's a good one! Do you want to be a part of it? It's our story! Good fishy, fishy. Good. Grendel! Madness to come alone. That's why I didn't. You're surrounded, Grendel. Liar. For the first time in my life, I'm not. It'll take more than one arrow to stop me. How about ten? Each one from a quiver of a ribe mercenary. Doesn't give a damn who he kills or why, as long as the money's good. 
Not a lot of poetry in it, but screw it. This isn't a poem. So do it. Kill me. We don't want to kill you. You liar. You know how we are. We like to eat, drink, fuck. Put on a good show with our armor and our swords. It's a bluff. Fiction. There's almost nothing we wouldn't forgive, forget, that meant we didn't have to fight. Well, most of us. Bribe mercenaries. What do you want? Peace. Liar! What other choice do you have? <laughs> Keep killing them. You went too far, Grendel. And killing them? That they could forgive. But you embarrassed them. You're the embarrassment. They didn't know that till you told them. Let them have their happy stories, Grendel. You'll be shocked what they'll pay for them. Shock me. How about a Grendel day? Grendel day? I told you they want peace so badly they're throwing you a party. They don't mean it. You won't know the difference. You're messing with me. You're all messing with me. And this, this is a trap. We're throwing you a party, and you're coming. If it's a trap, decapitate us. See you tomorrow, Grendel. What do you think, Fishy? Now what? Now the hard part. How's your day been? So get this, that Gayot, the monster hunter, she showed up at the creek while I was fishing. Tells me the Danes want peace so bad, they're throwing me a party. It's a trap, right? But then, maybe she was serious. Maybe they are that sick of dying. This is what I wanted, right? You always say I've got to welcome joy. I... I'm scared. Don't tell Mom, okay? All she ever wanted was for me to be happy. I don't want her to see me so... conflicted. That settles it. I'm going. If it's a legit party, great. If not, I'll just pop off a few heads and hightail it out of there. We're... we're pals. You'd help me out if I ever got into real trouble, right? Right? Right. Okay, bud. Talk later.
Grundle. Jeez, Mom. Can I get some privacy? I'm sorry, son. You look very handsome today. Thanks. Got big plans? Going out. Well, have fun. Be safe. Okay, Mom. Gods, Mom, what? I just wanted to say, we can't help who we are. It's not our fault if we're tall, or short, or skinny, or scaly. It's not our fault if we're dragons, or people, or grindles. All we can do is be the best versions of ourselves. All we can be is honest about what we want and what we need. Everything after that's negotiation. I know, Mom. I love you, no matter what anyone else feels. I love you too, a lot. Things are gonna get better for us. I hope so. But if anyone hurts you, what? I'll wreck the whole world. Okay, Mom. Whatever. got to do better. Starting now. Starting now. Yeah! Yeah! Can't get past those horns. I like the horns. His temper, though. I can fix him.
Grendel mentioned something about his mother in the meat hall the night we left. Yeah. There's no way she's not going to kill us all. Not after what we did to her boy. You'll be the trickle of the creek. Mist of the cave. Breath of a dragon. One with the moth. The darkness. The cold. Go, my boy. Go, Brindle. Get everyone inside. Barricade the door. Don't come out until you hear my voice. Beowulf, you have to protect them, Brucka. When I fail, it's gonna be up to you. You won't fail. <laughs> Go. Gayot, shit puddle, meat sack, bone sausage. Come on! My boy was beautiful, the last of his kind and the best. Your boy was a monster. So what? He only wanted to be included and you killed him for it. We're sorry. We're dumb and we're drunk and we startle easily. We're sorry. We're sorry. We're Sorry, but the killing ends now. I say when the killing ends. Unfurt. Messed up, didn't I? Yeah. People are dying because of me. Yes. How do I come back from this? Look to the careful one. Be better on Monday than you were on Sunday. 
better on Tuesday than you were on Monday. So on and so forth, till hell comes for you. I don't think I believe in hell. There's a monster outside, probably murdering my girlfriend. We all believe in hell. see it all so clearly where I came from how I got there the bad I did the good that came from it the people who paid the consequence and the words that have haunted me ever since what words my queen my best friend is a dragon. A dragon? Yes. I made you all believe there were countless monsters. The truth is, there were exactly three. We killed two of them. Can you imagine what it's like to be the very last? I mean, even if dragons were real, and I wish to the gods that they were, it's been decades. Oh, dragons are real. <laughs> I believe it with all my heart. A few decades to a dragon? It's a long weekend. Just enough time to work up a really nasty grudge. It's coming for us, for me. And it's going to burn all of this to the ground. You know what? I'm glad. Dragon smoke. One day, or 50 years, I'm going to spend the rest of my life doing right by you. That's what you said. 
I remember every syllable. There's more. More. And as I breathe my last breath, you will forgive me. Forgive you for what I'm about to do? For what I have to do? For what's waiting for me on the other side of those trees? This is my ending. I am your ending. A happy one. No, my love. I don't get a happy ending. Do it. Do it. Normally, people flee. We didn't really have a plan for someone to run at a dragon. Sorry.